Hello everyone, I'm Seth Amarasan here from Chennai Event Professionals, Chennai Event MCs and Chennai Event Entertainers, Event MC, MC Trainer, MC Manager and founder of Chennai Event MCs and Chennai Event Professionals and co-founder of Chennai Event Entertainers. Uh, today I would like to thank two, two important persons. Uh, one is my mentor Dr. Maharaja Sivashapramanian and second uh, Ms. Mareza who are the main reasons, uh, main reason behind the successful completion of this 365 days Facebook live challenge. Uh, thank you Dr. Maharaja and thank you Mareza. Yes, uh, with this, I'd like to announce everyone that uh, today is the 365th day I'm doing Facebook Live without uh, missing even a single day. How did it start? Uh, one fine day when I was in a uh, cinema theater, uh, it was on July 24, 2017. I was in a night show. I got a call from a mentor, Dr. Maharaja, at 10.30 p.m. And he told me that he's doing, he's taking up a, a, some challenge and he asked me if I would like to do it. I told him, yes, I'll do it. And he asked me to check the message and I checked it in Facebook. And it was a 21 days Facebook Live challenge. That was started by his trainer, Ms. Mareza, and he told me it's not compulsion. If I want to do, I can do. But I, I decided that I'm going to do it. When I was in the break uh, in the cinema theater, that is by 11:30 or something, I shot my first live. Actually, I've done a lot of Facebook live, but this one we took it as a challenge that we are going to do it every day. So that was the first live I did, uh, which is which was the part of the 21 day live challenge. And Mareza created a uh, Facebook group, and she was giving a lot of support, not only her. And not only she and a lot of their friends, a lot of the members who are part of that group, it's called as the 21 day Facebook live challenge. So everyone was so supportive and she has been sharing a lot of tips how to do a Facebook live, what all the technical problems would be there, how to solve it. That was a great learning experience for a lot of freshers who started the Facebook live. I was not a fresher by then, but still I was learning a lot from her tips. She was sending what sort of uh, topics we can select and Dr. Marja has also been helping me. And I shared the same challenge with Nandini, my business partner and my co-host. She also started doing it and she did it to a certain level. But after doing the 21 days, I didn't want to stop it. It became an habit. In psychology, they used to say 21 days period. If you do something for 21 days, that becomes an habit and um, you tend to do it regularly. That's why I started continuing doing my live and uh, there was not a single day break. Uh, to be very honest, there was a single day break uh, like uh, I slept in the night. But still what I did as soon as I woke up in the morning, that is in the midnight, like four o'clock or five o'clock, I did the live so that at least it should come in the previous day when I compare it with US timing or something. Uh, same way, there was another day when I did it in the midnight, like two o'clock. Except for that, uh, I didn't miss even a single day. I've been doing it regularly for the last 365 days, which means I should have 365 videos uh, in my Facebook. And also I, I have been downloading it and uploading it in um, my YouTube channel. You can check my YouTube channel our, uh, rather than saying my. I can say our YouTube channel because Nandini has also been doing a lot of lives, uh, Facebook lives. We were sharing all these lives. We are downloading it and uploading in our YouTube channel, which is called as the Chennai Event MCs live videos. So probably you can Google it or you can search it in YouTube, Chennai Event MCs live videos. So I've been uploading all those live videos in that. <clears throat> Once I complete the live within a day or two or maximum within a week, I download those videos and upload them. So we have more than 400, 450 videos there. How come we are now only three, six, five days have gone? We have been doing two lives, three lives in a day, some days, and Nandini has also been doing lives. So we have at least 400 to 450 videos in our YouTube channel. So what sort of lives I've been doing and why I why I started doing this and uh, what what was the uh, biggest impact it, uh, it had in my life? A lot of my trainees have also been asking me, um, so this would be an answer for them. So when we started this live, first thing, what we want to try is a discipline. When you do something, committed, uh, do it uh, daily or do it on a regular basis, you are developing a discipline, you are sticking to some commitment. That's the first thing we wanted to do. Second thing, when I start doing my live, my communication skill increase, my confidence level increase. So, and again here, I'd like to mention this. This live is going on in two pages. One is in my profile, and that, that is uh, through my laptop. And second one is going in my mobile in front of me. Uh, that's uh, getting shared in um, the 2020 FB Live Challenge. That's where this live started. I want those members also to see this. So first thing I said, it's discipline and the commitment. Second thing, um, uh, like as I said, the confidence level, confidence level increases and my delivery, the way I speak, everything uh, improves. Third thing, I tend to learn a lot because once the uh, stuff works in my mind is over, then I need to do some more research. I need to select a topic, do some research and then talk. So these are the ways, I mean, these are the um, consequences of doing a Facebook Live. So if you have not yet started your Facebook Live, please start doing it. Uh, it will develop your confidence. It will boost up your confidence. It will bring in a lot of uh, huge network. People uh, start following you and uh, there'll be a lot of regular followers. And there may be one time follower, like when they see your life, they may get some good stuff from you. And it becomes a discipline and uh, you build in a huge database. So if you have not started your Facebook Live, uh, start doing it. 
as i said 2 years back 2016 itself dr maharaja said i also shared it uh, in a lot of the platform that 2017 and 2018 is going to be a um, video era a lot of videos are going to be shared same way facebook live came in google hangout and lot of the um, uh, videos live live softwares have come so trust uh, trust me guys uh, please start doing facebook live and all of the live or video related things because next 2 3 years is going to be video era uh, which is going to be dominated with you know, video streaming software uh, or whatever related to video so this is one thing about this live challenge it started as 21 days and i wanted to continue i didn't name it as 365 days live challenge rather i wanted to keep doing it regularly until i am tired of or until facebook is gone or until facebook stops the live uh, um, facility so successfully it has been going on and one of the topics i have been doing uh, i have divided into three or four major classification one is uh, about even about my profession related in that i have split into two one is for my fellow trainees or for my fellow team members or fellow even professionals each one live is for exclusively for the even professionals they may be my seniors or they may be my equal team members or they may be my trainees and second live is second type of live is for the clients to understand what is an event industry how does it function third type of live is in my events whenever i'm in an event i used to shoot videos some um, sharing what's happening out there and fourth is the general topic that may be related to some school that may be related to my ngo activity that may be related to technology that may be related to railway station or anything uh, any uh, historical um, uh, events or something so i divided it into four things one is about uh, my profession events which is for the event professional second is about the uh, events for the clients third is directly shooting my events my event on nandri's event fourth is the general topic these were the topics i have been covering uh, and um, I, I i wish i keep doing it regularly so that others get benefited so from this second year i'm today i want i particularly wanted to do start this live at 11:55 or 11:59 uh, because july 23rd is a successful completion of first year now it's 24 july it's i'm stepping into the second year of my life so i want to do something more than what i've been doing uh, before so now i'm open to take some task like uh, people you can share your uh, views or you can share the topics which you want me to do live i have told you four different categories out of that yeah, any your, your topic can be anything out of that or even out of the topic if possible i'll definitely do the live or i'll ask someone or my mentor to do the live on the particular topic which you want so start sharing your opinions start sharing your questions uh, which of the topic you want want me to do the live or which one my supporters or my team uh, or my mentor to do the live definitely we'll do facebook live when uh, when time comes for that uh that's it for now uh, i had a lot more to share i think i have forgotten or something but almost have covered whatever i wanted to share let me sum up again first i wanted to thank two people one is marisa international trainer and also she is a trainer for my mentor dr maharaja for starting this 21 day fb live challenge and all those group members who were in the 21 day fb live challenge and thanks to dr maharaja shiva subramanian uh, my mentor uh, my business consultant coach and who has been the reason for all my success thanks to uh, dr maharaja for um, uh, helping me uh, start this facebook live challenge and thanks to my business partner nandini and all my team members who have been very supportive throughout this journey and uh, of course all the my live viewers uh, thank you so much and i have been doing all these lives uh, uh, even a lot of struggle lot of there were there were a lot of opposition for me doing uh, doing the lives so from my friends from even professionals they asked me to stop doing live they felt irritated i don't know what's the reason always when there is new technology that's coming in definitely people would be fed up when you overuse the technology but later they will realize why we have been using it and uh, they also start doing it in that way there have been lot of opposition when i started doing my live or when i continued doing my live but i will not stop it for any reason because i have a huge goal of serving the event industry and also my clients so i am not going to stop doing this live i'll be doing it regularly as i said earlier until i'm fed up or until uh, i'm stuck with a uh, huge commitment or until facebook stops the live option that's it for now any questions you can uh, feel free to contact me on my mobile number 9003087198 you can also visit my website www.chennaieventprofessionals.com thank you so much good night stay blessed this is mc damarasan signing off